Oh, dude, I've got one break. I can throw things away. I filled them up, so I'm away. Well, right now, you so know. So right now, hold my unit. Right now, absolutely <laughs> in a hold. <laughs> Basically, just resurrection from the dead, get it to spin over and hopefully run under its own power, and then obviously fix things from there. Worst case scenario, pull the cover off. Uh, timing belt is in multiple pieces and then bent all the valves, which are no longer available. I'm gonna have to basically shit them out or make them myself. To fix all the uh, hose clamps, all the hardware that doesn't look right. Just because it's easier makes me feel better about existing if I'm being honest. Right now we're loosening the accessory belt because it gets in the way of the timing cover on this model. If you're pretty sly about it, you don't have to take any, oh, the belt's rusted on. Oh, fuck me. Dude, dude, that's like crusty socks underneath the desk, dude. Dude, cut it. I don't have it. You tell me you're gonna reuse it. Yeah, <laughs> bro. So gotta do sparkies. It's never gonna work. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Two hours later. Well, anyway, since we're sitting here trying to start this thing after fucking ten years, it isn't that long in the car world. Oil slung off. Great start. Let's see how much oil's in there. Make sure it starts. Right between the dipstick. Nice. See that? Oh, it smells like fucking tuna fish sandwich rolled up in a fucking sandwich that you microwave for 10 minutes till it's crusty. One more time.